What's going on everybody? This is Cool Fury and welcome back to the Cool Fury Music Channel. Welcome back to another video. So, I'm just going to get straight into it in this one, man. I'm back on you simps out there. I want to talk about why this beautiful woman that you've been fantasizing about is not paying you any attention. Why this beautiful woman and other beautiful women just don't pay you any attention, man. Um, <coughs> excuse me. It comes down to availability, man. It's all about availability. See, when these women reach a certain level of attraction, right, there's more men that like them, that would want to date them, which means that there's more men that are available to them. And some of these men are considered more like top tier men to them. You know what I mean? A lot of these men, they make more money than you. Um, the woman might think that they look better than you. They drive a nicer car. They have a better looking home and all that type of stuff. So, you know, just imagine your situation, which a lot of you guys out there do. You got this girl that you like. And you have her number and stuff like that. Every morning you're sending a good morning text. Hope you have a great day. All that type of stuff. When she needs a ride somewhere, you're quick to say, Oh, yeah, you know, I'll pick you up. I'll be right over there. I'll, I'll take you wherever you need to go. So you, you give her a ride places. You know, every time she's having some type of issues with her friends or just wants to vent. She'll call you up and you'll listen to her and stuff like that. But um, at the end of the day, she's really not giving you the type of attention that you want. And the reason why is because there's somebody else out there that she really likes, that she really wants to date, that's better off than you financially. Like I said, she might feel like they look better nicer car, nicer house, all that type of stuff. And that's why she's not paying you attention. See, think about it like you're car shopping, right? Now, if you have a $100,000 budget for a car, are you really going to bother with a $25,000, $30,000 Mustang or Challenger? Are you going to bother with a, a used Chevy Impala? When you have $100,000 to spend on the car? Or are you going to be looking at these BMWs, Mercedes, things like that? A, a nice Porsche, you know. That versus some used $10,000 car with 80,000 miles on it. You're probably going to go towards the BMWs, the Mercedes, that Porsche out there. Because you have a $100,000 budget. And not a ten, fifteen, twenty thousand dollar budget. You see what I'm saying? Or imagine you're a hiring manager for a company, and you know your company is recruiting new people to come and work for them, and you have two hundred applicants, and a hundred of them have a an associate's degree or less, and the other hundred have bachelor's and master's degrees. So, more than likely, you're going to pick from the candidates that have bachelor's and master's degrees versus those that have an associate degree or less. You're probably not even going to look at those people. So, the next time you want to know why that beautiful girl that you're fantasizing over and that you're pulling all the Vaseline and Jergens out at night over is not paying you attention, just think about that because that's probably why. If she's not paying you attention, there's probably probably somebody around her that she's trying to get. He might be making $100,000 a year salary. He might be tall with the muscles driving that BMW. You might be renting an apartment. This guy might own a house. You see what I'm saying? That guy is probably somewhere around if this girl is not paying you attention. Because what it comes down to is that it's just human nature, man. We go after the things, we go after the best things that are available to us. See what I mean? Why, why settle for a girl? And I'm just telling you to just think about this for yourself. 
Why settle for a girl that you would consider a three when you can date a 10? You're probably going to go for the 10 if that's what you can get, if that's what's available to you. So it just comes down to availability, man. So that's all I wanted to say in this video, man. Um, if you like the video, please click the like button. Consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a comment so we can get um, continue the conversation. Definitely check out the other videos on my channel. Um, if you've been on this channel before, you know I am a rap artist, so check out my music. I'll leave a link in the description below for my newest single. And um, just like I say, man, in all these videos, be safe, be careful out here. It's a crazy world. And um, stop simping, quit being such a punk. And uh, I'll catch you in the next video, man. I'm out.